Uh, that'll make it their turn. Uh, they can move. They're going to take a move action. So one, two, three, four, five, six. That's all you can move. Thirty. A diagonal move is only one? Yes. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's thirty feet. One, two, three, four, five, six. That'll put it back to Jeremy. Um, okay. Me. John, are we giving Justin practice, or um, do you just want me to bake these guys? Uh, I mean, if you want to bake Let them. him practice as I cast yeah. Guidance. What I... See what I can do. Oh, guidance, because that was the most efficient move. Uh, how far can I charge again, Egan? What is the number? Uh, your movement speed, twice. So, so eight. I don't know that I can hit this guy. Does it have to be a straight line? Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can hit him. Does it have to be a straight line? You can hit every single person, yeah. Okay. It's the least obstructed path. Okay. Well, I can hit this guy. Uh, one AC, one bonus, one dodge uh, bonus to AC. <laughs> I smashed it to this guy with a roll of 30. One dodge bonus to AC, there we go. Uh, plus two your damage. damage on top of that, I hit him for 26 damage. Jesus I just Christ. roll out of the shack like, hey, I'm Delorius. <laughs> you, you completely, completely just mow this guy. You plow him down. You cave in his breast, and he's just. He cannot breathe. He came in his breast. <laughs> he cave in his entire chest cavity. Uh, he spurts out a large thing of blood. Uh, but you dodge it. And uh, he dies immediately. On contact. Uh, Egan, it's your turn. Uh, I'm going to delay and let Justin go first. Alright, Justin, back to you. So uh... I think I want to run over into the... Wait, how many moves do... Wait, how many... How do I determine how many move positions I have? Uh, it should be your speed which I think is normally 30 feet. I think you have six spaces unless you have something crazy going on. Yeah. Each I'd... space is roughly five feet. So... So where's where do I find my speed? Um... Because I have huge decks. Does that have an effect? Uh, it might. I'm actually not sure. I think it's 30 as default. It's for 30. Health. It's... Yeah, for uh, health. health might be faster. Let me figure that out. I'm going to keep Pathfinder SRD open. It is... Oh my god, please don't tell me about the religion. 30 feet. Yeah, I think it's 30. And Dex doesn't have an effect on that? No, I don't nope. think so. Okay. And each tile's 5? Yes, each tile's 5 feet, which means you can move up to 6 spaces. Oh wait, I can go diagonal. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I'm gonna go up here, distracting this individual, this goblin, over oh. here. Wow, uh, this can... this guy, this elite. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to distract this guy. All right. Uh, this he's, goblin. He's buying the bait. He looks towards you and raises his rusty knife. Um. It's their turn, unless Egan wants to take his. Oh, shoot. Um. Darn. What? I just remembered I, I get a movement to... after I pull off a successful stink attack. Oh, I'm going to cast is. Ant Hall on myself, and I'm going to run over, and I'm going to pick up Jeremy. <laughs> what? You have an ability that just... Okay. okay. I can hear another pants. You pick up Jeremy. <laughs> sure. That's it. <laughs> uh, Jeremy, delay your turn until mine, because I'm going to throw you. Okay. Didn't he already um, use his turn? He went first. The goblins yeah, next. The goblins should be next to the Jeremy. Oh, uh, okay. The goblins are, in fact, up. This one is buying the bait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Something stupid is about to transpire. Them or do a basic attack. And so... he, he rolls up on you, Justin, and he's gonna roll an attack. All right. So does seventeen match your AC? Okay, what's uh, Justin, Justin, what's your health looking like? Thirty-one. I might need to heal you soon. AC, AC, AC. I have twenty-one. All right, so it does not hit. Then uh, he takes a lunge at you. You swiftly dodge it like it's nothing. The other one is sees what's going on, and he's completely baffled, and he's gonna wait to see what happens. <laughs> so, uh, the hell are they doing? Are you delaying? I will delay. All right, All right. Jeremy's delaying. Uh, Justin, it is your move. Uh, I wish I had an attack or an ability that, like, if they it's miss me, I have a chance to, like, do something awesome to turn afterwards. That if that feat exists, I need to know. Uh, I'm sure there's gotta be a counter Yeah, there has to be like a counter attack, right? Um, Most definitely. So, we're, we're thinking that moving into cover and then jumping out of it does not work. That what we've kind of determined? Um, I don't really know how stealth works. I guess I need to look that up. what you want to do, and John gets the last say of who, if it works or not. That's yeah. Exactly works. Yeah, so what exactly are you trying to do here? After a very uh, dance-like dodge, I bounce up the tree and in one fluid motion jump out of the tree in a backflip <laughs> and land for a knockout on the goblin, not an attack. Alright, here's what I want you to do. I want you to make an acrobatics check for that. Okay. So find your acrobatics and roll a d20. Uh, I have eight acrobatics. Alright, roll a d20. Plus eight? Or just no? Yes, plus eight. Alright, uh, it's not the best roll, but I think it'll make do. I was uh, going for a knockout. You start climbing up the tree. He's going to make an attack of opportunity on you because you're doing something very silly right in front of him. Uh, he's going to miss because he sucks. Uh, he jabs at you, but you dodge it. You climb up this tree, you do a backflip, and you're coming down on this guy. Roll an attack. Uh, plus two for cool. Wait, what am I doing? I'm assuming you want to attack this guy after jumping off this tree, right? Yes. Alright, so roll your attack. Oh dear god, what was my attack again? Not a sneak attack, right? Just regular attack? Yeah, this is a, just a straight up attack. Okay. D20 plus 12. Oh, plus 13 because your guidance. I think I heard that somewhere in there. Oh, does guidance, is guidance persistent? Yes, it will. It's it's still on you. You, it's, you expend it on your neck. Yeah. Yeah. What? Where did I get the plus three from? Was that the sneak attack? The plus three was a combination of my bonus and Jeremy's bonus. Oh uh, right, right. On. Mine lasts for one round. So okay. All right. Sixteen. Ah, uh, fucking attack rolls, man. That is actually Garbage. not enough to hit the goblin's AC. So as you jump off this tree and attack him, uh, he kind of blocks it with his little shield. And uh, you, <laughs> you jump off a tree. And pretty much the only thing that ends up happening is you land behind him. <laughs> uh, he snarls at you. <laughs> um, was that I, considered a? That was not considered a sneak attack, correct? No, yeah, it was not a sneak attack. <laughs> Take that eyeball, man. <laughs> so, uh, Egan, it is your turn. Okay. Uh, I am going to do two things, John. <laughs> this will either end great or stupid. I'm going to throw Jeremy, and then I'm going to cast Quickened Alter Wind as he's in the air. And then I'm going to immediately cancel it after giving a burst of strong wind, which according to this is 30 extra miles per hour. Ooh. And I'm launching him in the direction. John, stop saying yes. <laughs> I'm launching no, him in the great. direction of the goblin. <laughs> <laughs> So you're you're catapulting Jeremy with a wind boost. No, I'm not catapulting. I'm fastball specialing because he's my Wolverine. You're fastball specialing Jeremy, the heavily armored dwarf, mm -hmm. into this goblin leap. Yeah. With 30 mile per hour wind. <laughs> Am I getting that right? Is that what's happening here? Correct. And because <laughs> stupid. And because you have ant hall. <laughs> Yolo. It's, he's, he weighs like nothing. No, it's fine. Okay. 
All right. Oh crap! You My acrobatics are actually 16, ball. by you the way. Determine what kind of bonus that is. You speedball special. Oh. He's just gonna have to make a reflex save against this wall moving towards him. Um, <laughs> let's see what he rolls. Um, he's gonna fail that uh, reflex <laughs> save and take the full brunt of a heavy dwarf's body going at 30 miles per hour. And so. Um, we're gonna chalk that up to uh, 8d6. <laughs> Uh, Jeremy, you have the honor of rolling it. You get to be a caster. Yeah, yeah you, get the, you get the honor. Roll 8d6. <laughs> See what you do to this guy. Um, Jeremy, you have, a you have a delayed turn. Do you want to, like, unball radius reaching and yeah. attack as you do this? With, like, a plus, okay, with, like, sure. a plus two to attack. <laughs> 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 Bear hug. <laughs> I will, as I'm flying through the air, I will connect with him and then go for the stab, I guess, against his touch. Alright, yeah. Just for, because we're flavoring up this combat so much. <laughs> Alright, that's good enough for me. Uh... <laughs> hey, you should have rolled a number on those dice. Get him. It's exotic um, dwarven longsword. You're gonna do, uh... That's we gotta what, give the audience a show. 33 damage to this guy. Boom. And knock him back. Two spaces. Uh, he's flat on his ass, prone. <laughs> but he is alive. He is still alive. Um. <laughs> For fuck's sake, it's Mr. Eyeballs. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the goblins. Uh, this little goblin's gonna attack you, Justin. By the way, I remind me to consult my character sheet more. I actually had 16 acrobatics, not eight. Oh jeez. Yeah, that makes a big <laughs> that difference. Been, that would have been much better. Um, yeah. This goblin's gonna roll up on you. Oh, he's gonna crit fail! Uh, so what happens, uh, he tries to stab you, kind of misses, and brings his knife into his own armpit. Cause... He was just <laughs> so... He was just so off balance after all the yeah. conspired earlier. Yes, yeah, so like... <laughs> 24 <laughs> hour projection. He turns around and into himself. And while dodging, he's swinging and cuts his own artery. <laughs> Yeah, he's gonna do <laughs> one whole damage to himself. He's gonna do a whole damage to himself. Oh, a whole damage. In this attack. Ow, I um, scratched he's, myself. He's kinda scared and he backs off. He takes a five foot step backwards. Did you just stab me in the armpit, sir? Please stop. Um, so he backs off a little bit. Um, this goblin leap is gonna take his move action standing up. And he's gonna, uh... He's gonna throw a knife. He's gonna throw a knife at you, Jeremy. Uh, does, uh, <laughs> does 13 do <laughs> No, it doesn't hit me. Alright, this knife bounces off your armor harmlessly. The hilarious looks upon extra droop. Oh, what strategy such for us? Wow. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm sorry. I'm going to come up a tree, bounce off the shield, land, go like, yeah. Come up the shield, come up the third artery, and you can do the like. <laughs> Intentional. <laughs> hey Primrose, thanks for stopping in. This is the first time I've ever played D&D, so I'm totally at a loss here, but we're having a good time. <laughs> Man, he's just replacing Scott all around. Oh he's great. To come back. <laughs> but I have the acrobat for it. I, I think I have the stats for this. Mm -hmm. Maybe. We'll find out, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, right. Uh, the knife bounces harmlessly off Jeremy. Uh, back to you, Justin. Oh, my turn? Uh... Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's Jeremy's turn. Uh, okay. Touch him in the booty. You know what, since we're just fucking around, I'm gonna try my, um, that rock ability. <laughs> that rock ability? The, the oh. ability where I literally hit a dude with, a, like, a, a magic rock. Okay. I just wanna try it. See what happens. I can fucking find it. It's a wind pun. Alright, here we go. I see you smiling, John. You saw my wind pun. <laughs> you just walk up and Swiss cheese him. Oh, I wanna try to hit him with a rock. Alright, here we go. How do you not have bull rush? It's gonna rock his world. Hey man, victory's just a stone's throw away. 
Teus pernas. Teus pernas.